my lovelies welcome back to my channel and a brand new video <laughs> my friend coming over haven't seen her last week you guys know it's Josie anyway so I am happy I've had my breakfast I can't get over how great yesterday was we all got on so well and it, it made me emotional because it was so nice it reminded me of the old days when me and Ryan were kids and it was his weekend to see us and it made me go back to those days and <laughs> anyway I've had my breakfast I treated myself to peanut butter on toast I mean I lost weight and I thought let's have a little bit of a treat peanut butter on toast I'm about to have a shower and I haven't used strawberry shampoo and conditioner in a while and I'm excited. Anyway, <clears throat> once I've had a shower, I will decide whether to put makeup on. I'm just deciding no, I won't because I've realised that not only did I run out of foundation, but I also remembered that I ran out of mascara as well. Good times. Anyway, I'll see you guys in a minute. So minute. this is the outfit of the day love it so much i just plaited my hair after my shower i didn't really know what to do with it so this is what you're getting but i'm loving it so much it's so warm today i don't think i got any sun cream need to have a look i doubt it but i'm not sure anyway i'm waiting for jocelyn to turn up i need to wash up um so that um, I know that's done. And then I am ready to go. Oh, I need to get the peas out of the freezer. Because Jocelyn has said that she's going to bring some oats. I've got some peas. And they're really good um, food for the pigeons and the ducks. And yes, we are going again because we really liked it last time. It was such a nice day. Right, I'm off to go meet Jocelyn. She's on the bus. And I'm going to head over and go and meet her, which I'm looking forward to. And she hasn't seen me in this outfit and didn't know it ever existed. So that's exciting. I look forward to seeing what she's wearing. We well. are on our way to the duck pond. And we got a bag full of goodies here for them. We've got oats peas and sweet corn and all stuff like that and breadcrumbs. and breadcrumbs I know you're not really supposed to give them bread but it's only breadcrumbs it's not a lot really mm. but yes it is absolutely billy boiling today mm. really really hot we'll hopefully get to uh, it's <clears throat> probably going to get up to around 22 degrees yeah 22 that's quite hot do you know what I am a really patient person, but the number of people in their cars that drive past and don't let you cross. Yeah, they didn't, not one of those cars let us go past. Not one. No, yeah, exactly. Which is fine, but I don't think they realise what a journey we're going on to get to where we're going. And yes, hopefully today will be the day that I actually brave it and let a pigeon eat from my hand yes. but don't get too excited oh hold on guys I'm getting it. so it turns out we forgot there's a fair on and it's absolutely heaving oh I wish we could go on one of the rides but we have no change we have no change and I, I think it'd be too hot going on the rides but we'll go and feed the ducks and the pigeons and we'll chill out over there but then on the way back, we'll have to stop and check it out here. Because I forgot this was here. But that's cool. We'll check it out on the way home. The fair is here that we forgot all about. Well, I live here and I should know, but I forgot. There were signs everywhere. Watch, wait for that, guys. It's going to go around. I'm sure we've all seen one of those. I'm waiting now. I just want to stand here and wait for it to go. 
We're nearly at the docks anyway. In we go. Fuck a duck. I've been on worse than that. I went to four Park. do. Look at that. I would be sick. You would be sick? Oh my goodness, look though. Wow. Anyway, we'll come back here. We'll do a load of feeding and we'll come back. But we've got to check it out. We've got to check it out. They're not so playful today and surprisingly those things are not being greedy. Yes, I'm talking about you seagulls. You're not greedy which I'm surprised about because we brought a lot of food today. A hell of a lot of food. Bless. We decided to dip our feet in because it was too hot and we just couldn't not. But the coots are chasing and playing with each other. The ducks were, but they're not now. But they're so just being the so, so cute. The lake. Now they're getting a bit greedy. That's better. That's what we know them for. Hey, you leave that. Stop. <laughs> oh, no, don't stop. <laughs> just <laughs> shouted it. The coots. Hello. Shoo. It went on her back Shoo. almost. Don't you dare start. I'm not having you starting on that coot again. After what happened last time, he almost got a sprained leg. Nice. She's being nice. Yeah, they're actually being nicer today. Yeah. Whoa. Good mood. Unlike last time. Bit of fighting going on. But apart from that, we're all good. They're being really sweet today. <laughs> Ready? Look at him come back up. Oh. Jocelyn's feeding the goose. Ow. <laughs> Just okay. don't say what you're feeding, okay? You be careful. <laughs> they don't mean to bite, they're just hungry. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Nice sleep. <laughs> nice sleep. <laughs> they're just hungry. They're just hungry. Wait. 
Ow, ow. God, you can do my fingers. <laughs> Cutie. Oh, we really like her. Gorgeous. Hello. Let me fuss you. You don't want to be first. Oh. We're at the fair, but I think they're charging to get in, guys. Which never used to be a thing. It is so busy today. It's not the busiest I've seen it, but it's still busy. Look. Yeah, there's a look at the queue to get in. That is a really long queue. It's not worth it, is it, if we're not really going to do any of it. Huh. So busy here today, though. We've been in the fair. It's not quite what we expected. I didn't know whether to find it not as fun or really fun. The first ride... Jocelyn bossed it, she was brilliant, wasn't sure at first, but she really went for it, didn't you? We went upside down and everything. Yeah, we did, upside down. It was good until we went upside down, but I've been on worse. I went on Soaring Colossus and things at Fort Park. I know I could really, I know I could handle this. Anyway, um, so we've been in the fair, done that, we had a nice sit down, we're heading back to mine and the shops so Josie can get a drink and we can just head back yeah today's been good. in case you didn't know tonight for dinner we're having um spaghetti carbonara it's just me Josie and dad because Lucas has gone to his dad's last minute which has actually really annoyed me because we plan our week and he knows this but it is what it is we're just doing it without him. Anyway, so we are almost at the end. Um, and then we can make our way slowly, continue to make our way out. And then we can chill when we get back. I say chill. I've got to do dinner. Either I'm doing it or Dad's doing it. I don't think it really matters who does it. I'm just in, in no rush. I want to cool down. I'm, I'm making spaghetti carbonara for dinner, teaching Jocelyn how to make it. We got the bacon, we don't have the cheek of the animal because well, it's expensive and dad finds it too fatty. We got onion in there, the pasta's going, the egg is ready. Yes, it looks like that, there's pepper in it. I know it's best to use white pepper, but it's locked down. We have got whatever's available. So we're just waiting for the pasta. And then when the pasta's done, we can mix the egg in. And then the dish is ready and we can eat it. It's going to be delicious. I haven't made it in a while, but I can't wait to tuck down and eat it. All I need to do is allow the pasta to do its thing. Oh, quick tip. When you're draining your pasta, guys, don't run it under the cold tap. It gets rid of the goodness. The same with mint. And it's actually the same um, when you overboil your veg, it gets rid of the vitamin C as well, just as a quick little reminder. Plus, the pasta water adds flavour. Don't add all of it because then it will be really liquid and that's just silly. Just add a little bit because you don't need a lot. And trust me, a little bit of pasta water, blimmin' makes a big difference. Alright, it really, really does. Anyway, I'm going to double check the pasta. And a lot of people say, um, don't add oil to the pasta please when you're boiling your pasta add oil do you know why you add it it stops the pasta from sticking together and it bloody works the next day and just before it ends the video happy pride month everybody today is the first day of the month of pride which is supposed to be over two months now i think they upped it to two months instead of one i'm not sure so they've added the letter i and the letter a i forgot what the i means i was told independent um but i'm not sure what the a means yet anyway 
I will find out and then as soon as I know I'll let you know if you're interested. You might not be interested, but I'm interested. <clears throat> anyway, I'm going to end it here and see you all tomorrow. Bye, everybody.